I correct, correct people. Olori Miriam humiliated inside uh, Kabiese's chamber as we heard that the security guards had to drag Olori Miriam out of uh, Kabiese's chamber for doing the unthinkable. My correct, correct people, good morning, afternoon, evening to you all. According to your time and the time where you take the CD's video, you are welcome back to Tessis TV. Now we are still on the gist about waiting the sub for inside the palace of a Oni of Fife. My correct, correct people, we heard that Olori Miriam was humiliated today. This evening, as we are hearing, right inside the palace of Oni, inside Kabiese's chamber, as she went there with the intention that she is going to stay there and sleep with Kabiese till the next uh, morning. That is what we heard. That when she came in, Kabiese was enjoying his evening meal that uh, his cook prepared for him. So after Kabiese finished uh, his evening meal, Kabiese came out to attend to Miriam to know why Miriam is looking for for him. So as Kabiese came out, he sat on his throne. Olori Miriam was sitting down, greeted Kabiese, yes. And then Kabiese was like, what have you come to do? Any problem in the palace? Is there any way I can be of help? That is what we heard Kabiese asked Miriam. But Miriam couldn't give a tangible answer to what Kabiese asked her. Rather, she said that she has come to Kabiese's chamber to relax. That uh, she felt like coming down to Kabiese's chamber to stay today and have a good rest so that tomorrow morning she will go back to her own apartment. And Kabiese was like, wow, I did not summon for you to come down here. I can't remember sending the guards to go and summon for you. And she said, ah, uh, she know, she know that uh, she was not called, but she felt like coming down to Kabiese chamber to spend the night with him. That was when Kabiese knew that uh, Olori Miriam, she get mission. Yes. And remember, if a priest then warned Kabiese clearly, don't you ever have anything to do with this Oloris until they are purified yes they need to go for sanctification they need to come for if a shrine for sanctification because some of them not all of them as we heard has been going behind your back and doing some unclean things so you didn't you do not have to share bed with them so that you will not contaminate what they are carrying and since then, where if a priest then won't Kabiese finish? We heard that uh, Kabiese has been taking precautions. That's just the truth. Kabiese has been careful. And that might be the reason, like people are saying, that is why she bring in Queen Naomi into the palace. Yes. So as it stands now, we heard that immediately, although Mariam finished saying that she has come to the lax, Kabiese knew that Miriam has come for something. Yes, that it has been long, you know, she she felt Kabiese's uh, a hug and all that. And she has come to spend the night in Kabiese's chamber. When she said that, Kabiese knew that something is not uh, right. And we heard that Kabiese told her, you cannot spend the night here. You cannot spend a night in my chamber. You didn't inform me any. And you are not the one to tell me who I will call to spend a night with. And the reason why Miriam is doing all this too is because Miriam has been seeing Kabiese and Queen Naomi in that chamber. Yes. Sometimes we heard that uh, in the evening, Queen Naomi will just go down to Kabiese's chamber. They will, be sit, uh, they will sit and be chatting and all that. Sometimes she will spend night there with Prince Tadinekao. Sometimes she will spend night in the royal manor. So the Oloris has already been in their apartment and be monitoring what is going on between Kabiese and uh, 
praying that Omi and they are not satisfied, they are not happy because Kabiese has excluded them from his side timetable. And that is why Miriam said, let her go by herself to go and meet Kabiese. Yes. To talk to Kabi and say that she wants to spend the night. It is not only with Naomi that have you. We, your wife, we are also in, I have you. We are also among the people that have you. Not only with Naomi. But Kabi and say, remembered what if a person told her. Don't you dare eat the forbidden apple again until they are purified and sanctified. If not, don't go close. So immediately that word clicked on Kabi and head. Kabiesi knew that Olori Miriam is not something, is not who he is going to, you know, say in the palace through Adonai till tomorrow. We heard that Kabiesi asked her to leave, gently leave, you cannot stay here. Immediately Kabiesi told her that she raised her voice. She started uh, shouting that Kabiesi has not been fair to her, that, you know, she was crying on top of as she's shouting we heard that she's crying that Kabiese has not been fair that Kabiese has been maltreating her that you know she was saying all sort of things that pissed Kabiese off the next thing we had alleged is that Kabiese called onto the Kabiese called onto the guards around asked them to bundle Olori Miriam out of his chamber it is already evening so she doesn't have anything important to tell me to, so take her out. As Olori Miriam was shouting, she was quarreling Kabiese. We heard that the security bundled her out and lock up the small gate that is uh, blocking that Kabiese's chamber. And we heard that Miriam was outside, she was crying, she was out shouting that if it is a uh, mommy Tadinika, Kabiese will not, uh, you know treat her the way uh, KBS is treating her way be Olori Mariam. That KBS has been so unfair that since uh, for the past two, three months to four months now, KBS has not done anything with them, but KBS is doing whatever Queen Naomi wants. My correct people are waiting there. So KBS was left speechless as we heard, because this one, another Wahala, these Oloris has not, I don't think in a day they have allowed KBC to drink water, drink cup. But people are saying that it is good because this is what KBC brought upon himself. If he had controlled his emotions, if he had controlled himself, if he had learned to apologize to Mommy Sardinica when they had issued that, this thing would not escalate to this extent. So right now, my correct people, this is what is happening in the palace as we heard alleged. I beg and I beg, drop your comments, drop your suggestions, drop your opinion. We are seeing it. And don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to click on your notification bell. Stay tuned, stay updated for more updates. We'll be dropping from time to time about waiting the stop for palace of owning of Ife allegedly.